YouTube, what is going on? It's your boy. It has been quite a while, uh, but I'm back, back recording. Um, a lot to catch you guys up on. I took a break. I just took a break from social media for months. I just took a break from just like a lot. I haven't trained that much, um, but I'm getting back to my routine. Just, just wanted a mental break and just to focus on some other stuff. Um, we got a chance to go on our dream vacation to Italy uh, two months ago. Now, yeah, two months ago, um, got a chance to. We stayed in Rome, but we got a chance to uh, take a cruise along the Amalfi Coast, Positano, Pompeii. We uh, stopped by the Vatican City. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful trip. Um, anyway, so, but today. We are headed to the Johnny Jackson Classic. Uh, one of my clients um, is competing today in men's physique. Dude looks awesome. Made a crazy comeback from being shot a couple months ago. Got his finger shot off. And to be able to recover from that and train, he got the justice training. It's a crazy story, but um, it's the best he's ever looked. Dude is shredded, confident. I think he's going to do really, really well. So we're actually headed there now uh, to just see how he's looking. And then we're going to head into prejudging. But um, on the way, I'm kind of on the go. So i got to eat my breakfast while I drive here. But I do have some protein pancakes, courtesy of Biotech. Uh, these are made, if you want to scroll down, these are made from um, chocolate protein. Uh, the new weight protein for Biotech Code Hunt. It's really, really good. It's got some egg whites. And I'm going to wash it down with some uh, Before You Gain. Oh, shit. Some Before You Gain. Take two of those. And uh, that's it. So, anyway, feeling good. We'll probably do some training um, sometime in between uh, prejudging and, and finals. And then we'll head back to finals uh, later on this evening. So, full day, but I'm excited. And let's get it. Go again. Oh, no. Turn to face 
this front. So we have 29 and 32 switch places. Turn the face back. Sorry about that. You go, you go. Great job, you guys. You can follow out to your left. All right, so prejudging is a wrap. Um, I think it went well. Interesting class. I think the guy who I think is going to take, he's going to probably take the overall um, in both the novice and open. Dude just looks really, really good. I, I can't even, you know, it looks good. It's got like a very complete physique. Um, I think my client did well. Conditioning overall was good. I think we could fill out a bit more. I was trying to play that balance between fullness, but still maintaining, you know, conditioning and dryness. It's always a that constant, you know, balancing act, if you will. Um, the fact that, you know, this guy he just got shot a couple months ago, uh, got his finger shot off in an altercation, was able to recover, um, relearn how to hold things and um, train and get around that and to go into prep and they kill it for 18 weeks and for him to look I think the, the best he's looked on stage which is great um, and the fact that we have 17 pounds to give before we even make weight you know as far as like the cutoff so that gives us even we got plenty of room to grow and I think physique wise he's complete um, just had a little bit of issues as far as like ab control on stage I know he was uh, he mentioned you know having some gas and just like a uneasy kind of feeling going in and you know part of that's just just the process some things that I'm kind of adjusting and I, I kind of know you know how to go you know about it next time and just have them come up a little bit fuller maybe push the food just a little bit more um, he did have a burger and fries um, with some fluids took a nap and I just got to check in you know, it looks way tighter and you know I just wanted to be a bit more conservative because I wanted to make sure he was diced and then make sure that I was giving him enough carbs and, and keeping him you know hydrated as far as like his uh, sodium goes. But it's that's just kind of the name of the game, man. This is just, you know, it just takes a while to kind of just find that perfect formula and, and perfectly nail it. But he did look really, really good. I think he's in a solid third place uh, for both novice and open. The guys that I think are... First and second were the same guys that were in both classes. So, you know, judges, I mean, if they got you in one place, you know, the chances are you're going to be around the same place in another uh, category. Um, so, yeah, fun show. I My hand was probably shaking when I was recording because I was trying to record on my phone and the camera. So, apologize if you do see the shaking by the time this comes out. Um, but, so, uh, right now he's going to rest up and we got finals here at five o'clock so in about four hours and it's it's a relatively um, smaller show uh the johnny jackson classic uh, shout out to johnny man he's just i didn't have so many great conversations with johnny you know along the years uh, i remember when both me and johnny were competing not together but i was an amateur he was a pro so doing his thing training with branch and um we'd be training in the same gym and at the same time that we had a uh, the same coach slash mentor coming up, one of them, and uh, he's always been a solid, solid dude. Just, just always treated me well. Always had a great conversation. Always good vibes. He's one of the the pros out there that are just real, real solid. There's a lot of there's a lot of people that are, to be honest, self centered, you know, assholes. To be honest, which is why I don't really like to be around a lot of people in the sport. I don't really like going to attending shows. I've never attended the Olympia. Or the Arnold, although I've competed in the Olympia twice, I've never actually got a chance to, to be in the mix and go to the expos and um, as a, you know, on the other side. So, but just being a competitor and kind of rubbing elbows with these guys and, and just between the internet and, and real life, I mean, there's not a lot of people that are genuinely solid and have been for a lot of years. Johnny's one of those guys that have been. So, um, shout out to him. It was good seeing him and the show for prejudging was a really good turnout even though it was a smaller show 
Um, I can imagine that finals here in a little bit is going to be a really good turnout. I think my brother's even going to try to come through. Um, my brother's been training a lot. You know, you'll be seeing more of him too. He, I do want to get him on stage. I think just for what I saw, like especially like the true novice, because he's never he's never competed. Doesn't really he trained, but he's. I'm trying to get him back. I'm trying to get him to where uh, you know he looks good not only in the gym but for the stage. So he's lean, but I really want to prep him and like you won't really need a, sh uh, a long prep. He's already super shredded. But um, uh, just genetically, he's just super shredded. But anyway, I want to I want to bring him. I think he's gonna come through tonight in the finals, kind of see, you know, what all is like being a fly on the wall, if you will, kind of see like the process of bodybuilding show. So that'd be cool. So um, but before we do any of that, we're gonna train. I'm not sure what we're gonna train. Maybe some pull, maybe some push, maybe both. I don't know. I'm kind of just getting into the swing of things again. I got my pre workout in here. Uh, my before you train. And I actually topped it off with a little bit of glutamine, so I have both. Uh, both are from Biotech. You can get them both um, on their website. You can use code HUNT with an E at the end uh, for a nice little discount. And that's it. So we're gonna sit this, drive, relax a little bit, and then um, after we train, we'll relax a little bit. Then we'll head to the finals. So, crazy. All right, y'all, so we got back day. I asked the wifey what she wanted to train. She said she wanted to train back, so we're going to hit some back. Uh, so we're going to do like a little variation of pull, maybe throw in a little tricep, but just a quick little pull day, get some blood in the muscle. Uh, so we're going to start with a super set, a super set that I've been doing for a long time, um, just some wide grip, lat pull downs, and then we'll super set with some uh, low, low V-bar uh, cable rolls. So we'll just do like three sets of those, keep the reps between uh, around 12, and then we'll probably move on to some other kind of like rowing movement or something. So. You know what I hate? Yo, you know what's funny? You that walk in the middle of my set. I remember I almost shot somebody. True story. Remember when we all, you know, I'm gonna say, when I was prepping for the Olympia, jacked out of my mind. Somebody did that, and then he followed me to the parking lot. True story. I damn near shot that man today. Bro. Literally, no, bro. Uh, what's next? Um, let's do one of those growing machines over there, and then we'll do maybe another kind of reverse lat, and then we can bicep. Muscle.
It's been a while. I'll wake these boys up. Juice a little pump. You got a house three? House three, yeah. You got one more and then we'll do some, uh, maybe it's like some hamstring, the hamstring, hammer curl. We'll finish it off. Damn, I should pump. It's cool, little, yeah. Cool, little push, uh, pull workout. All right, pull. You good? Got a little blood in. So, we gotta go home, shower real quick, and head to the finals. So, we get up out of here. Alright guys, so that is a wrap um, as far as my competitor goes. Um, so we ended up taking third in both the novice uh, men's physique and open. Um, the guys, the two guys that beat them were the same guys that pretty much in both divisions. So they're not going to change your, you know, score if they already had you third. It was tough because first, you know, we pretty much knew, I mean, that guy just, he's pretty much on the cusp of turning the pro. Looks amazing. Shout out to him. Shout out to him, whoever he is. Uh, hold on. Sorry. Um, second, I, you know, it was, it was kind of a toss up with second. Um, I think, you know, my guy had better, like a better physique overall, but second place, the dude just had a really, really tight core and kept, you know, as far as like his composure and holding his core tight. Um, and you can see, like I was right behind the judges and you can see like they were kind of like not really sure, kind of moving him, but I can kind of almost see in real time, like what they were kind of looking just for being in the sport so long. I kind of instantly knew like, oh man, like he, I was trying to yell like, hey, keep it tight, keep it tight, keep it tight. But it is what it is. It's, it's part of a, <clears throat> sorry, part of a learning experience. I was there many, many times, even at pro shows, you know, I, I was, it's happens. Um, so he's going to eat now and we wanted to do a show in two weeks. Mentally, he's kind of not really feeling that right now. And I totally understand. I was once there. I can't, you know, he's, I almost backed out of the Olympia uh, because of that. Um, doing a show, same scenario. Did a show, 
two weeks before the Olympia, and I was just so mentally just tapped out and just like just not there. And you know, the best thing in that situation is kind of waiting. To, yeah, so that's it. Um, so we'll see. And I'm gonna let him get a couple days to himself, kind of just reflect and get some food in the system, the tan out of off his body, and hopefully you know have a conversation either tomorrow or Monday. And uh, if not, I mean, I'm still super, super proud. I mean, the dude looks amazing. Like I said, he got shot, uh, got his whole finger shot off in altercation before we started prep. So there's a lot he kind of had to, you know, relearn how to grab things and how to train and that kind of, you know, got to get that connection and holding stuff. And um, but still super, super, super proud of him. And regardless of his, his decision, he's worked his ass off and it's the best he's ever looked. So. We're done. We got our little Chick-fil-A because I'm hungry. I missed like a whole bunch of meals because I was back and forth at the show. He was running around backstage making sure he was good. But uh, we're going to eat this, head on to the crib. But I promise, I promise we're going to be back on these YouTube videos um, monthly. So maybe maybe semi-monthly, but for sure at least well, at least once a month for right now. But uh, until then, guys, hope you guys like the video. Like, comment, subscribe. I'm going to go ahead and eat because I'm hangry. And till next time, y'all. Peace.